Well, no complaints here. We had some great weather today. Yesterday was beautiful. Keep it going. Sunshine. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Sunday, <laughs> oh, Sunday, right. Sunday. You know, uh, uh, not going to be doing a whole lot of that. I know. It, that's always how it goes. Yeah. yeah. The return of old man winter is set here. We're going to mm. see some, maybe some uh, slick spots on the roads tomorrow okay. morning and then Wednesday night into Thursday. We're talking maybe some good snow. Hmm. We'll have to watch this one closely. Right now, all is quiet on campus. Uh, it's cold because we are seeing mainly clear skies right now, but overnight tonight, clouds will thicken back up, and so that will uh, keep temperatures in the low 30s, I think, overnight tonight. But right now, we're at 42 degrees. Most everybody's sitting in and around the low to mid 40s. A little bit colder as you head further north. That's where we're seeing the cold air coming in from, right? That combined with moisture from the south, means things could get a little bit slick tonight and tomorrow morning. Uh, so far, it's been a fairly quiet day with mainly clear skies, but the clouds are moving in from the south. The leading edge of these clouds mainly just upper level clouds, but as we head throughout the overnight, they'll thicken up and then sure enough down to the south, there is some light rain falling. This moisture is going to try to push its way into parts of lower Michigan. That combined with the colder temperatures overnight, means that, yeah, we could see some slick spots on the roads. You'll see it here on future track. Now, I think this model might overdo it just a bit here, but you can see by about 5 a.m. showing some snow, some rain. But I really think what we're going to end up seeing is just a lot of low level moisture, some drizzle, things like that. That, when it touches a solid surface, when temperatures are just below freezing, means that we could have some icy spots on any untreated roads. Now, if the roads are treated, they should be okay. But with that, again, early Tuesday, there could be some slick spots on the roads. Aside from that, Tuesday is quiet. We'll see kind of a partly to mostly cloudy sky. Wednesday, a quiet start to the day, but watch what happens later. Here's 6 p.m., and you can see snow is on our doorstep. And yes, it does look like this is going to be moving through uh, Wednesday night into Thursday morning by 10 o'clock starting to move in and notice how by daybreak Thursday a lot of lower Michigan uh, seeing some snow falling maybe a bit of a mixed precip or some freezing rain or sleet uh, just to our south and east. I really think this is going to be more of an impact for the folks in Toledo. For us, I think it's really just going to be snow, but it will be a close call heading into the afternoon Thursday. A few lingering snow showers, but it's really going to be Thursday morning that we see the bigger impacts over the next couple of days. So tomorrow morning, yeah, some slick spots on any untreated roads are possible with uh, maybe a little bit of freezing drizzle in some spots here tonight. Most of Wednesday is quiet, but late Wednesday and the Thursday snow is expected, and so with this, I think Thursday is going to be the more impactful day. You will likely have to shovel some snow, maybe even snow blow it. And yeah, the plows will be out at work uh, Thursday morning as well. We'll talk about just how much we might see coming up tonight on the news at 10. As for tonight, I think that we dropped to near 30 degrees. That's going to be around 8 or 9 a.m. tomorrow. So most of the night will fall through the 30s. And there could be a little bit of that wintry mix or that freezing drizzle. But again, as long as the roads are treated, they should be okay. Back roads will likely be a little bit slick. Tomorrow's high 36. That's going to be shortly after midnight. Most of tomorrow will be spent in the low 30s. A colder day with, aside from that uh, threat for some slick spots early on, it should be a fairly quiet day. Late Wednesday into Thursday comes that snow. And I think that we're going to get a few inches at least with a few flurries lingering into Friday, Sunday night into Monday. More snow likely to return. A couple things to keep an eye on. We'll yeah. have to watch and see how the models evolve. We'll check them at 10. We could use some snow. We could. The slick roads I don't like, but the snow we could use. I'd rather go for the sun, but you know. I mean, I'll take sun, yeah, yeah, yeah. but you can't sled in sunshine. That's right. There we'll you get go. Some, yeah. <laughs> All right, Brett, thank you.